on the northern edge of the Washington Nissan car plant sits the former Three Horseshoes pub. At one time, the building stood at the edge of RAF Usworth, home to 607 County of Durham Squadron, who played a crucial role in defending home shores during the Battle of Britain. 15th of August 1940, from Norway uh, and the Scandinavian countries, the, big, the largest daylight raid on the northeast was on that day. The various squadrons met them, 607 was one of them, and they basically gave them such a good beating that they never actually came back in force in daylight ever again. This heroic action and the role of RAF Usworth and the station's commanding officer, Francis Blackadder, have been commemorated with the unveiling of a blue plaque organised by 2214 Squadron Air Training Corps, supported by the Washington Area Committee. The plaque was unveiled at the Three Horseshoes, which once served as the officers' mess. You can tell that it's such a historical site. We've got rooms to the upstairs and things, and you can kind of see that it's, it's an old building and so and kind of to know that it was such a sort of a place of significance, I think that, that's a really great thing. In recent years, Wearside has seen an upsurge in the number of historic sites marked in this way. We've done quite a few blue plaques lately for people who've been real heroes, and I think it's especially important in this year, being 100 years since the end of World War I, that we do recognise these people and it's an amazing opportunity for them. The headquarters of 2214 Usworth Squadron Air Training Corps is within sight of the plaque's location and is a tangible link between the airfield and its Battle of Britain commanding officer. When Blackadder left the RAF, he actually became the commanding officer of the Northumberland Wing of the Air Training Corps, as it was then. So there was a direct link, if you like. Well, it's fantastic to have something like this on the property. I think it's, it's, it's a really historical site, and for something like this to have that, the recognition there, it, it, it's a fabulous sort of accolade for the pub. It's the airfield, it's the people who served on the airfield and the events that occurred around of, a, of an aviation nature. Blackadder, we've all heard of the Blackadder. Well, this is the real Blackadder, and it's fair that we should commemorate that down the RAF.